Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. Another supermarket review. Today I have on the menus roast chicken roll. Heat and eat in two minutes. I uh, don't think there's much to this roll. I don't think that there would be lettuce on it. It looks like it's just a um, plain uh, sesame seed roll with mayonnaise, I'd say, inside. I don't know if this is the roll that I used to eat from the service station after a big night. <laughs> Could be the same one, I don't know, we'll find out. It looks very much like um, the to ripper roll from Red Rooster, so I definitely hope it tastes the same as that. Let's try it out. Okay, out of the box. It's packed with chicken, so we can't complain about the lack of chicken in this roll. So it comes in a tray, so you just have to take it out of its um, packaging, I guess, or maybe just open the packaging up a little bit and heat it up in the microwave and you're, you're done. So easy. Okay, it's finished nuking. I'm gonna pull it out, oh wow. Nice, oh, oh, it's very hot. <laughs> nice soft bread, sesame bread. Wow. It looked like a lot of chicken when it was frozen, but now that it's actually been nuked, it doesn't look like much chicken. Okay guys, this roll cost $3.90. Um, it's packed in chicken in some areas and not in the other. Maybe just got um, moved around in the box, you know, in transport. I don't know. Um, the bread feels very soft, but for $3.90, I don't know. I could have gone to KC and bought a $4.95 fill-up meal. Anyway, I'll just break off a little bit at the end. The chicken seems moist, not too dry which is a good sign. Incredibly, it's not dry and the bread is soft, but it needs more inside. The chicken is only very mildly seasoned and not, um, you, know, um, you know, super flavorsome, I guess. If I just poured some more mayo over that, it would be perfect. But what I'm amazed about is this bread. It's been in the microwave and it's like super soft. That's really cool. This just needs a little bit more tender loving care, I guess. Some more mayo, I guess. I don't know. Um, <laughs> um, maybe just, you know, if you can, if you can fit anything else in there, um, maybe a little bit of lettuce or something. I don't know, just something um, to pack it up a bit. On its own, it's okay. It's um, a little bit bland than what I can remember. If, it, if this was the same um, hot roll that I used to buy at the service station, I'm pretty sure that it is. It definitely, the bread reminds me of back in the day, definitely. But the inside of it is different. It doesn't taste the same as it used to. It used to be like, you know, oh, so yummy. You know, that's why I kept on buying it all the time because it was just so delicious. Now I'm not finding it as delicious. Maybe, you know, I've moved on, but I'm gonna pack a whole heap of mayo in this right now and um, chow it down. And uh, that's the end of my review for this. It's not bad, it's not fantastic. It's in the middle, I guess. You know, I probably would keep one in the, in the, you know, in the freezer for emergencies. If it was on special, I guess I'll probably buy it again, but otherwise I probably wouldn't. Anyway, that's my review for this um, on the menu chicken roast roll. Hope to see you soon and uh, it's goodbye for now and take care and I'll catch you next time. Bye guys.